Am I the asshole? For calling my friend a coked out loser? I'll call my friend Kate. We're 32F. We've been friends since high school, though we're not as close anymore. Different interests, different places in life. Kate has never left her parents' house. She works a lot, and parties even more. She's often partying with people a decade younger. She does cocaine sometimes, and it makes her quite verbally aggressive. All of our friends are married, having kids, and she's made comments when we've gotten married, such as saying she's really not sure a couple that had been together seven years was ready to get married. She hasn't ever truly been in a serious relationship. A lot of us have, frankly, chalked it up to jealousy. I'm pregnant now, finally. My husband and I struggled with infertility for over two years. I am in my second trimester. I got together with Kate and a few other friends the other day. I had a feeling she was on coke, just from her eyes I don't know if these friends know she uses. This conversation ensued. She asked me out of the blue will I be a good mum? I said sure. She started saying she knows she'll be better than me. That she's more emotionally stable and I'm not. That she's raised kids before she worked as a nanny for a couple years and just not everyone is meant to have kids. She said if I am not ready for this, I shouldn't do it. She said I have options. I was in shock and beyond hurt. Kate is well aware that we've gone through fertility challenges and treatment. She knows I'm thrilled to be pregnant. This conversation occurred completely out of the blue we weren't talking about my pregnancy at all. I snapped and said I know I'll be better than a coked out loser who hasn't left her parents house. And I left. One of my friends texted me that that Kate was very hurt and I should apologize. I may have gone too far, but I'm still beyond hurt by what Kate said to me. My husband, who doesn't enjoy Kate at all, told me I don't need to apologize he wants me to cut her off completely. Am I the asshole? ETA I do not believe Kate is addicted to cocaine. You guys know that kid in high school who would brag he had 472,882 shots of tequila followed by even more shots of vodka the night before, and you knew there was no way? That's kind of Kate. You have to take what she says with a grain of salt. My response would be, I'll apologize for calling her a coked out loser when she apologizes for suggesting that I'll be such a shit mom I should abort my very much loved and wanted baby. Then let silence reign. Put your phone on mute for 24 hours and go do something nice with your awesome hubby. Not the asshole. Your husband is a smart guy. You should marry him. Not the asshole. Do you care she was very hurt? Wasn't what she said very hurtful? Why are your friends asking that you apologize for your comment, but not asking Koki McGee to apologize too? Not the asshole. It sounds like you outgrew this friendship years ago. What she said was outright hurtful and malicious. You should not invite her back to your life. Not the asshole. JFC you're not remotely TA. Why are you still friends with this person? You've obviously grown in different directions and it's okay to let those relationships that no longer serve you fall away. Let this be one of them. Let anyone else who butts into this situation to advocate for Kate be another one. Good luck with your pregnancy, birth, and motherhood, heart. Not the asshole. Your friend out of the blue says you'll be a bad mom and you should abort, and then gets upset when you call her what she is? Nah. I second hubby's recommendation of cutting her out completely. She's obviously one of those friends that's you're only seeing because you've been friends for too long and there wasn't a good enough reason to stop being friends. Now you have a good enough reason. Not the asshole, I would also cut ties with her. It's hard to be friends with someone when they just won't keep their opinions to themselves. She started saying she knows she'll be better than me. Her co cues aside, this statement itself is incredibly obnoxious. She's basically saying you are not fit to be a mom. Drop her. She has no respect for you frankly she is rude as hell. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. 
I usually read these titles and my only question is is your friend a cooked out loser? You post says yes. Congratulations on your pregnancy and listen to your husband about cutting her out. She's not bringing anything positive to your life and so doesn't need to be in it. Not the asshole why do people feel the need to comment on other people's parenting skills before the baby is even born? Sounds like she's jealous and was trying to take away some of your happiness. Not the asshole. Do you really want your baby around someone who uses cocaine? Cut her out of your life. She's toxic for your family. Not the asshole. She's jealous, so lashing out at you. Cokeheads will say some seriously stupid shit. I say this having been there done that in my youth. Not the asshole she was incredibly rude to you, if she can't handle the heat, she needs to stay out of the kitchen. Kate does sound like someone who would be better as an ex-friend, than someone to have in your life. Congrats on the pregnancy. Doing cocaine at a laid-back hangout with your pregnant friend, means you are addicted to cocaine. If this was a big party or even out at a club where the purpose was to get smashed then it would be plausible to be a social cocaine user without an addiction, but it doesn't seem like your hangout was giving cocaine party vibes. Not the asshole. The things she said were calculated to hurt, they really couldn't have been otherwise. Not the asshole I'm about as pro-choice as it gets, but telling someone to their face I'd be a better mother than you, so you should abort your unborn child is vile. It's deeply over the line, and there's even further context of overcoming infertility, which can be really traumatic, and her never having been in a stable place to be a mother. I mean, come on that's pretty top tier stuff. It's pretty hard to top that in terms of offensiveness. She sounds easy to dislike, but even easier to pity. The poor woman needs to sort some shit out. Not the asshole it sounds like she had it coming. Very fair response to what she said to you. Not the asshole. What you said was rude but Kate was also very rude. Why does she feel the need to berate you on certain things and potentially others? Like you said probably because she is jealous. TBH I agree with your husband it's better to cut her off completely rather than being around here. But in the end it's your choice. Natasha was out of pocket and you had to remind her that she's in no place to be talking. Not the asshole. Take what she says with a grain of coke lol. Not the asshole. I'd have blurted the same kind of thing out and that would be the end of my friendship. You are pregnant. You don't need that kind of friend around you during the most precious and stressful time in your life. I hope the rest of your journey is easy and your birth and baby are healthy, smiling face with hearts. Not the asshole, listen to your husband L. Also, text the friend who said you should apologize back and say nope I'm incredibly hurt by her words too. I don't want an apology, but I no longer wish to be associated with her. I wish you nothing but the best. She needs to exit your life very quickly. I know you said you don't think she is addicted but if she can't be at a friendly dinner and not be high she has a problem. Sounds like she has many problems. She needs help soon. I would be scared for you to even be around her. Oh and those other friends need to get bent. Cut them out too because the last thing you need is them stressing you out over defending yourself. Not the asshole, and I would dump her as a friend. Not from the drug use or her life choices, or for being behind you in terms of maturity. But for the fact that she is incapable of being happy for other people. She seems like no matter what happens to people in her life she assumes she would be better than them if she was in their situation, but that's unfair and selfish. Do you really want her to be in your kid's life? Natar. What you said was true. She's a woman in her thirties living at her parents addicted to cocaine I'd cow she could not be a loser in that scenario. Kate definitely has a coke problem though she doesn't have to be selling all of her possessions and living on the streets to be considered having a drug problem. Her doing coke in a normal not party setting where no one else is having a grand time whilst hurting her friends is a clear sign that she has a problem. Not the asshole. Kate is very toxic you don't need that in your life especially while you are pregnant. Your husband is right to cut her off completely. 
not the asshole. I mean, she does coke. So your assessment of her being a coked out loser, seems fairly accurate. Not the asshole. Don't start no shit, there won't be no shit. If she can't meet with friends before doing a line or more, Kate has a problem. What she said to you was reprehensible. That she suggested you abort this pregnancy, especially given your history, is far beyond the pale. You don't owe her an apology whatsoever. Not the asshole. The friendship has played out. You are at different stages of life. You are about to start your own family and that should be your priority. I agree with your husband, you should cut ties with her. Congratulations to you and your husband you're going to be an excellent mother. You're not the ass. Uck. I was Kate from 2000 to 2003 when I finally kicked my habit. You are not the asshole, but Kate needs help. If she's anything like I was, she will ruin her friendship with not only you but probably several others before she finally decides to get her life straight. Congrats about the baby try to put the Kate thing out of your head. You usually can't reason with a cokehead or their enablers. Maybe coked out loser was a bit harsh assuming she has a coke problem? But your friend bringing up pregnancy and weirdly saying she would be a better parent was bizarre and uncalled for. If you can accurately label someone coked out semi-frequently, you can accurately label them a loser. Not the asshole. Partying like that, gets lamer the older you get. You two aren't compatible as friends anymore. She says hurtful things to you and you two have nothing in common. Relationships end. We just have to be self-aware enough to let them go when they do. ESH.